Hello, everybody, and welcome back to MarTech Tuesday. Today, we're going to talk about Databox versus Clipfolio. So these two are amazing analytic tools that allows you to connect many different data sources and create data boards. So you can actually see all these multiple sources in one place. They're both amazing tools. They're both very similar, but we're going to talk about why we use Databox and why if you are using HubSpot, you should use Databox too. So uh, this is a good example of a Databox board uh, put together from data with you know, Wistia, HubSpot, and some calculations put together. This is a good example of how we track the impact of video, how video closed at three times the rate as uh, when uh, when video is part of the journey on leads. So um, of course, you can connect different multiple sources on both tools. Both of them have amazing um, educational resources, uh, but uh, there are cer certain differences on these tools, and we're going to talk about that right now. Uh, one of them is price. Price is very similar, but uh, Databox is actually cheaper than Clipfolio. So that's one of the things that we give to Databox, uh, especially if you work with an agency because Databox has amazing um, relationships with agencies and a great partner program where they actually give you bulk prices if you're an agency. So if you work with an agency in HubSpot, um, you're gonna get probably Databox at a fraction of the price or free. We offer Databox free for all of our customers. Uh, so that's one of the differences right there. Uh, then the their education program, both of them has have a lot of resources and a lot of education programs, uh, in, including uh, Databox has this whole methodology with predictable performance, which is amazing. And uh, they just launched some amazing videos. So I would recommend checking those out. Uh, but they also create a lot of content for, uh, for, for uh, marketers and salespeople out there. And actually, a lot of it uh, about analytics in general, uh, they aggregate content from many different thought leaders and experts in the industry, uh, including a lot of agency owners like myself. Um, and then they aggregate these uh, these surveys that we, they put together and they put amazing pieces of content regarding SEO, how to do marketing in 2020, trends on specific things like Facebook ads and how to track all these things and how to make sure that not only you're like showing uh, success or looking at data, but also how to make decisions from data to actually predict the, the future and, and make sure that you create an impact on your marketing and sales efforts. So uh, that is actually more important than just looking at the data from the past. And that's what uh, predictable performance is all about. So of course they have very similar features. The pricing, like I said, Databox is a little cheaper. Um, both have great training resources. Um, Databox has a great partner program, uh, and that partner program actually creates templates. So because partners are part of this, every partner creates templates, and it's very easy to create things from templates. If you say HubSpot as a source or Google Analytics as a source, you're going to have hundreds of templates available uh, that people that do your job already or even, you know, marketing experts or sales experts or business owners put together for you already. So that's uh, a huge advantage in, in Databox is the partner program and the templates that come with it. Now, Clipfolio has more sources, so you can actually connect with more integrations than Databox. That's something that we definitely have to give to Clipfolio. Uh, they also have uploading files. Uh, both of them have uh, integrations with Google Drive, which is pretty cool. Uh, there's a difference with uh, Clipfolio. They allow you to connect directly with an API, which is cool if you have software that, that has an API. Uh, now, with Databox, you can still connect with an API by using other tools like Zapier and, and some other ones. A lot of them are free and or very inexpensive. So you can still connect with an API. You just need um, a piece of software in the middle to do it. So what I would give Databox uh, more than anything else, other than, of course, being the most popular HubSpot um, analytics tool out there um, because a lot of agencies use it and the partner program is amazing, um, I would give it the, the, the ease of use. You know, creating boards in Clickfolio is harder than it is in Databox. You, you still have to choose the source and sometimes you can create specific custom 
um, you know, power metrics and things like that. Uh, Databox has a drag and drop system that works amazingly. You can just, like, just grab something from any source. You have all your sources here connected. And from any of the sources, you can just look for the data, you can search for it, and you can just drag and drop the information, and then you can resize it or do whatever you need to do. So it's very easy uh, to do this and very easy to create boards by just drag and dropping things in there. Um, one thing that I also love about Databox, uh, both of them have great support, but Databox has this chat support that's super fast and super great. Uh, people at Databox know what they're talking about. It, they're not going to send you to someone else. So uh, chat and email support is free and it's great from them. Um, and then the other thing is like because they cater to agencies and because they're so involved in the HubSpot community, they have invested a lot in the HubSpot integration. So if you're using HubSpot, not only because of the connection with HubSpot agencies and the partner program, but also the integration with HubSpot is a lot better. There's so many more data points that you can use information from. So um, like I said, both of them, great tools. We recommend definitely using Databox um, and just little differences here and there. But if you're using HubSpot, we definitely recommend using Databox. All right, thank you and happy MarTech Tuesday. Take care, bye-bye.